What's up, family? Welcome back to another fragrance review. And as you hear, y'all, I'm jamming <laughs> on the mothership. So guess what? Welcome back to the mothership. It's another fragrance review with your brother, your friend, your homie, Mr. Russell Mack, y'all, the OG. Uh huh. And this is Solomon V. How y'all doing today? It's a Monday. Let me go and get his phone to Talia, y'all. Y'all know I love this music, so I don't own the rights to any of the music, guys. Uh, so listen, I hope you're having a great day. I was off today, so I relaxed all day, ran a few errands, and now I'm back home ready to do a fragrance review. Listen, if you're new to the channel, listen, I need your love and support. I need your help. We're shooting for 1,000 subscribers. And we are on our way, and we are doing a great job analytically. We are doing a great job uh, overall. Listen, for all of you that are new to the channel, those of you who have been around the channel for a while, thank you, thank you so much. I appreciate the love and support. And listen, come on, we need some more people to come travel this, this frag journey with us, come hang out with us, come do lives with us, fragrance reviews, top 10, all that good stuff. Listen, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel is all you got to do. And come have fun with your boy and the OG, Mr. Russell Mack. Today, my scent of the day. Oh, listen, don't forget to hit the bell icon to y'all. All right, sorry. Listen, I'm rocking hot I just finished off my little B camp, my little 5ML, and I'm smelling so good, y'all. And I'm not really getting Creed Aventus. I got it in the opening, but after that, this thing took a flight and took shape. And it's doing something else on my skin, and it is radiating. I've had it on now almost all day, and it's smelling real good. Still, I love it. Hachivat by Nishane. Now, the fragrance we're talking about, and I only have a little bit left, and this is Go Dolphin by Parfums de Marley. I just sprayed the rest on my wrist, and this is a fragrance that Tyrone sent me a little sample of. Uh, he didn't want to sell me that bottle, though. I tried to buy it off of him. He didn't want to let it go, but he did send me some and told me to smell it and see what I think about it. So now I got my own bottle coming, okay? Go Dolphin. Uh, I like the name, but I don't really understand why they named it that. But, hey, we'll put the bottle up for you in the notes. There's your bottle right there, that pretty gold bottle. There are your notes. I'm not going to try to go through every note on that uh, note table, but it's classified as a leather fragrance. Came out in 2010. There's your nose behind the fragrance. And what this fragrance basically is, it's a light leather scent. It opens up really strong, though. And you got notes like cypress. You got saffron and thyme. You got green notes and fruity notes. Wow. But then you have floral, a floral heart, jasmine and rose, orris, okay. And then you got some musk and leather. You got vetiver. So it's a lot of notes, but what you basically get here is a leather fragrance, a masculine fragrance. I won't say it's mass appealing. This is a sophisticated um, complex fragrance. It's one that you have to really like. You have to kind of be up on your niche game to really get uh, the enjoyment from this fragrance that Parfums de Marte, uh put into it. It's very masculine. It's very uh, powerful in the opening. You're getting this strong saffron with leather uh, and thyme in the opening with a few fruit, with this fruity accord, which doesn't stay uh, around very long, okay? But then you start smelling some of the heart notes. You get the greenery. You get this earthiness from the, from the vetiver and the base. You get a musk that sweeps throughout the fragrance, throughout the entire fragrance. You get some of the mate, but it's very nuanced. It's not really loud. It's not really noticeable. But if you smell for it, you can smell it a little bit. But you're basically getting this fresh and clean, earthy, green leather scent. And this is one of the best leathery fragrances I've ever smelled. Leather is one of my favorite notes. It doesn't take this suede-like smell. It's not what... It is. It's giving you more of a smoky leather almost, okay? You're getting this earthy vibe in the dry down. Now, I got the dry down over here, and what I'm smelling after about four hours is a lot of the leather, musk, and vetiver with green notes. All of my fruity notes 
basically it has gone, has evaporated, but it is a light leather scent. So I got about five to six hours of great performance. Um, but after about six hours, I got more of a really light, close to the skin, leathery, musky fragrance. And it's real nice, very elegant. And this is one, you see that bottle, that's why I want this fragrance because of that bottle, that all gold bottle. I want to put it up on my shelf. And because it's so pretty, I love Parfums de Marley's bottle, high quality bottles for a high quality fragrance. So this is a manly scent. I say, sample this one first. Don't jump out and buy this one. They cost a lot. So I would say sample it first if you want to try it. Many of you have already had this fragrance, you know all about it. But for those of us who haven't tried it, I'm a little late to the party, but I love it. I love it. It's my kind of fragrance. This, this is one that I would, I'm not going to say it's too versatile. This is one you definitely want to rock when you want to feel like a boss, when you really want to go out and make a great first impression. If you and your girl going to hang out for the night on a beautiful Saturday night, spray this on. Drop the top. Yeah. Put on some Go Dolphin. I love the name. I don't know what Dolphin got to do with it. But, uh, hey, we know what a Dolphin is, right? <laughs> so, I love it, guys. I love it. Go Dolphin. Get your nose on it. See what you think about it. I say go and try you a sample. Check Fragrance X. Uh, maybe uh, Parfums de Marley. Or wherever you get your decaf. You check, uh, check, check with Mo. Over at Chef Kent's or Fat Boy Fries. I'm sure he has it. Check his store. Uh, or check Venable Fragrances. So you have a lot of places you can go before you purchase this. Uh, thank you, Tyrone, for the sample. It's a fragrance I like that I'm going to purchase. Wow. Go Dolphin by Parfums de Marley. Well, guys, that's it. Thank all of you who, sticks, who stick around the channel. Those of you who come on my lives and hang out with your boy, I'll be doing a live soon. Uh, and I listen, I don't eat Chinese food, but that don't mean you don't eat it or can't eat it. So I understand my channel not for everybody, all right? I, I'm not for everybody. So if you got a problem with what I'm saying or doing on my channel, you know, all right? But for those of you that love me and for those of you that know me, thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. God bless you. You're always in my prayers. Thank you all again for stopping by, hanging out with your boy for a few minutes. I'll see you guys soon, right here on Solomon's Video. I'm out of here, y'all. Take care. Peace.